it's reading time and in our reading lesson for today i'm going to show you what a plot is a plot is tells what happens in the story for example in the story the animal the animals and the mirror it tells act two scene two and tells what happened in each act and scene for example pete did the pig to tell what how Pete the pig looked like and how his action worked. That is called a plot. A good plot is you need exciting events, interesting characters, and you think what makes you wonder next. Wonder what is next. For example, I am having a story. If I were an astronaut, at the end of the story I said, then we heard some strange noises. What could it be? I stop at the end of the story. If I get to publish that story, people will think, oh, what will happen next? And they will be curious to know what will happen next in the story. Here, in the story here, the animals and the mural, you will see that they also show all the characters. Of course, you have known the ca character in the first day giver. Act one, scene one. Here, there are characters that they do this to know that we should use, we, for example, Anna should read this, Mary should read that, kind of like that. Please wait. Okay, so for in here, in the story of Follow the Leader, it says the words of the sheep in the flock that have been more frightened than he. At the end here, they said, oh, what happened to the baby? Did Louis learn his lesson? Did Louis lead the sheep? So you need to, in the story for Follow the Leader, it says creative writing. That means you need to write an ending for the story. How can you write it? You need good plot. It means you need interesting characters, exciting events. How about a kitten's war? In this book, Among the Animals, there are lots and lots of interesting stories. You should read them to know that they planned a good plot, they have ex exciting events, makes you wonder what is next, and interesting characters. Keep reading and you find more, more interesting stories.